These protesters are crying out for the 1,006 women that were silenced in 2019 at the hand of femicides in Mexico. The country is one of the most dangerous in the world, and on average, 10 women are killed there every day. Protests like these are now a common scene after each femicide. But two killings in particular shocked the nation and filled anger on the streets. Ingrid Escamilla was stabbed and skinned by her boyfriend back in February. Images of her corpse circulated throughout national media, leaving Mexico stunned. And just days after, seven-year-old Fatima also became a symbol of femicide in the country. Her body was found mutilated, leading thousands in the country to breaking point. We're scared for our children. It's scary to not know what could happen to them. In the last year, thousands of women have rallied onto the streets. They accuse the government of inaction in the face of mounting femicide deaths. I am open to anything that helps bring peace and tranquility to the country. We will continue to work to make things better. But this was not enough for this mother, whose daughter Maria Lima was killed by her husband, a Mexican police officer. I cannot help but think that President Obrador is not doing his duty and is not doing anything to ensure justice for femicide victims. Yet it is his job to protect citizens. Maria Lima's case made headlines back in 2010 after her death led to the landmark ruling that meant all murders of women could be considered as femicides.